Hi, everybody. Can you listen to me? Guys, can you hear me? Guys, can you listen to me? Guys, can you listen to me right now? You there? I don't know if you can hear me. Les escucha y se les vi. Si, si me escuchan, pensé que tenía problemas con el micrófono. Altavoces, sí. Ok. ¿Me escuchan bien? No se me escucha trabado. ¿You there? ¿You there? Yes. No. Ready or not for the class? Se escucha bien, teacher. Se escucha bien, ok. So, 
we're going to start with well first of all i think um i hope that you are good um creo que hoy se les pegó las sabanitas a algunas personitas y eso que es de noche pero vamos a comenzar con el topic de hoy just give me a second to show you my presentation Ok, permítanme. Talk. Ok. I'm here, I'm sorry. So, I'm gonna show you the presentation right now. Tell me when you can see it. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yes, Thank you. So we're going to start with, uh, it's another topic. We're going to see like a modal verb. And, but first of all, we're going to talk about races. This is about, uh, this is a reading. And we're going to talk about races and we're going to do it. And then we're going to have a speaking activity of um things that we were practicing, of course. So we're going to start with the reading and I'm going to show you this screen. Is it just lucky? See. So I need four volunteers to help me to read. This is a race in the United States. So we're going to find like um we're going to read like about unique American races, que son algunas de las carreras en Estados Unidos que existen. So, um, let me know who wants to read this. Cuatro voluntarios necesito para leer este. Tell me, who wants to read? Delby, okay. Delby va a ser la primera. Después Jennifer la segunda. Silvia la tercera y Andrea la cuarta, okay. Ya les di los numeritos. So we're going to start with the first one. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Okay. One moment. One moment. Okay. Okay. Este... Si me lo puedes subir un poquito. Okay. Listo, ready. Eh, es el que está en amarillo, ¿verdad? Que empieza con take. No, no, es el que empieza con climb. Climb the stairs. Climb the stairs of New York City. The Spice State Building in the Temple State. The Golden Woman. The trip is in the middle of the 55th. And... 32 zero meters. En 86 floors. Uy, homie. I can't see. Uh, no. Floors or one, five, seven, five steps. Uh -huh. I don't say 1575. Okay. Winner can reach the top and just 10 to 11 minutes, can you? Okay. Repeat after me. 1,000. 1,000. 500. 500. 500. 100. 75. 75. Excellent. Okay, thank you so much. Esa es una de las carreras eh, estadounidenses, right? Like climbing to the Empire State. Um, I estuve en todas las escaleras del Empire State. So it's like, 
86 floors, 86 pisos. Oh my God, I could do that. I couldn't do that. I can't do that. Um, yeah. Yeah. It's like too much for me. Um, I couldn't do that. Um, do that, that race. Definitely. It's not for me. <laughs> okay. No. <laughs> yeah, you neither. You neither. <laughs> Yeah, I understand. I can. It's like, oh my God, that's too high. I, I, I will. Sometimes I feel like I can't breathe in the third floor on, on my on my building at the university. Third, the third floor, el tercer piso, no digamos 86 pisos. Son 83 pisos más. I can't. No, never. <laughs> okay. It's much more hurt yeah that's not a good idea definitely but then people like it that's people that like it so it's okay <laughs> yeah. okay who wants to be uh, who who wants who were the next Samo? okay uh it empieza con take but that see okay um take Eight or ten days to arrive across America from Irvine, California, uh, Savannah, Georgia. Savannah, Georgia. Okay. Uh, cross the entire U.S. in the two thousand nine hundred miles. Uh, four thousand six. Hundred six. Sixty seven. Sixty seven. Uh, bicycle ride. In this ride, there are no time out for sleep for eight to ten days. Racer can sleep only about three hours each day. Okay. Look at this. Oh my God. 10 days. Esta carrera dura 10 días. And they can only sleep 3 hours each day. Cruzan todo Estados Unidos en bicicleta. Oh my God. I couldn't do that too. Uh, definitely, I am not for race. I am I am thinking about it right now with this reading. I am not made by uh, like a deported, um, uh, like an, an sport guard board. Uh, but uh, I I I couldn't I couldn't be in the races definitely is like too much for me. Okay, we're going to continue with the third one. Who was the the, the number three? Okay, race on the exceeding white waters on the Arkansas River in the down rim race. Winner can play the 25 um, point seven. Point seven miles, uh, 41.6 kilometers in just two hours. This is the longest don't ride race in the USA, one person, one vote take the challenge. Yeah, definitely no one of these races is for me. Um, this is Down River Race. Es un, un, un río de Arkansas que es bien largo y los competidores van a 41.5 kilómetros. 41.5 kilómetros en dos horas. Oh my God, that's a lot. The, and it's only you, you with your boat. I don't know, I, I couldn't. Um, definitely there, there is not for me. <laughs> okay, and we're going to read the last one. Who was the last one, Andrea? Uh, hi. Hi. You uh, are the last one, right? Oh. Only possibly in Alaska, the Aditaran Sleep Dog Race, race from downtown, insurance to know over 
eh, One Town No sé, no me puedo muy bien. No me gusta. Ok. Repeat after me. One Thousand. One Thousand. One Hundred. One Hundred. Fifty Miles. Sixty Miles. One Thousand. What Thompson? Eight hundred. Eight hundred. Fifty kilometers. Kilometers, my. Uh, there's cold with uh, snow. Winners usually finish the course in the eight, no, nine, pardon, to uh, el doce tampoco. Me acuerdo. Twelve. Twelve. Repeat. <laughs> The 12 days and recibe cost price. Okay, that's good. Thank you so much. So this is another race uh, with, this, uh, with these dogs, right? It's only possible in Alaska because it's in the snow, okay? Through the cold, el frío, wine, el viento, and the snow y la nieve, right? So it's like to course nine to 12 days to receive cash prizes, says. Oh my God, that's a lot of days. I, I couldn't do it too. I don't know. This is not for me, the race for the United States. What do you think about it? Do you think that you could do any of this? ¿Alguien cree que podría ir a alguna de estas races? Yes. No. Why? No. no. I think about no. Why? I think about no. No. <laughs> uh, I need uh, a lot strong. Um, I believe that I don't have uh, a lot of strong. Okay. Yeah, it requires a lot of, sorry, it requires a lot of exercise before or I couldn't yeah. do that. <laughs> yeah. yeah. They have a good condition, physical condition. Yeah, uh, of course. Yes, I don't have that. I can to go uh, uh, a competencia for, for sleep. Yeah. I can. Yeah, I could do that too. I'm very good yeah. to sleep. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, that can yeah. be one of my favorite um races because I love to sleep. I really, really love to sleep. And I could sleep a day. Yeah. Yo no sé si alguna vez alguien ha dormido un día completo, pero yo sí. <laughs> yo sí he dormido un día completo, 24 horas. Yeah, of course, I did. Eso, eso ya no se llama dormir, eso se llama hibernar, algo así. Ay, yeah, no. Yo sé que es una exageración, pero créanme que he dormido de unas formas, ¿me se imaginan? Súper, súper. Uh, I really, really love to sleep. That can be my rest. That can be my rest, definitely. Okay. I understand. I couldn't do that too. Okay, we're going to stop. Oh, well, do you have any question about the, the vocabulary? No. No. Okay. So I'm going to stop the screen and show you my presentation again. Okay, that was the reading. And we're going to have this activity before to see the um the what is that? the dance so this is class picnic okay we're going to uh have a group work and we're going to plan a picnic okay so you are going to choose two main dishes los main dishes son los platos principales okay lo, lo, como lo más fuerte lo más fuerte que van a comer two salads dos tipos de ensalada two drinks dos tipos de bebida and two desserts like dos tipos de, de postres And then you are going to tell me, like, in our picnic, teacher, we're going to have two main dishes, a hamburger and pupusas, for example. We're going to have, like, a French salad and a fresh salad. And this, right? You are going to plan this with your group. Esto es por grupo, right? So, van a, pueden utilizar algunas useful expressions, like, um, 
uh, we don't want to eat beans, for example, in the main dishes, so we choose um, rice instead. Y no queremos comer frijoles para los platos principales, así que escogimos arroz en vez de frijoles. Okay, instead, en vez de eso. Okay, you can, uh, this is gonna be a group, a group um, activity. So you can take a screenshot for this. Le pueden tomar screen para que tengan el, el cuadrito y alguien anótelo y definan quién me va a contar el ejercicio, please. Okay. So you... You ready? ¿Alguien tiene alguna duda acerca del ejercicio? Eh, vamos a, a, a como comentar, a suponer que estamos en una como competencia, ¿verdad? Y, y con qué nos alimentamos. Yo creo que es más bien como si fuera a tener un picnic con estas personitas. Como, ah, ajá, ah. y elegirlas, elegir los platos, las ensaladas, los, los tipos de bebida, los tipos de postre, ya, yeah. it's a plan, ¿Qué, ¿qué tiempo se utiliza para cuando nosotros planeamos cosas? El futuro. Yeah, the future, also you can use it the tense what you want. I only want the plan, ¿ok? Yo quiero el plan, que me cuenten qué van a comer, qué ensaladas. Aquí les dice que tiene que ser dos tipos de cada cosa, dos, dos main dishes, dos salads, dos drinks, dos desserts, ¿ok? Dos de cada cosita. So you're going to do it in group, of course. Se van a poner todos de acuerdo y luego alguien me va a contar qué es lo que planearon para su picnic, ¿ok? Thank you, chef. A pleasure. Ok, creo que ya le tomaron todos el screen. Voy a detener mi pantalla y les voy a poner en las breakout rooms. Go guys.
I think we are all getting back. <clears throat> sí. Okay. So, do you, well, ¿cómo les fue en el ejercicio? ¿Lograron llenar la plantilla? No sé cómo, es que se me, como, sal, alguien se salió, creo, y de cuando volvió a entrar lo envió a otra sala y había más en una sala que en otra. Pero no les quise mover porque dije, no vaya a ser. So, how was the class picnic? Did you plan your picnic? Do you want to, to share the picnic with us? Your plan with us? No sé si nadie participó, este, teacher. Yo puse algo um, de, del menú. Ajá. Pero no, no lo pudimos compartir porque nadie ni siquiera enciende los micrófonos. Entonces, así como. Oh my God, really? Wow. Sí. Que eso no me había pasado en ninguna clase hasta el momento que, que no encendieran sus micrófonos. Usualmente en las en los breakup rooms ya se ponen como a, a discutir y así. So, what happened? El, eh, Silvia, ¿verdad? ¿En cuál estaba usted? ¿En la 1? Ay, no me fijé. ¿Cuál número era? Ok, but you did it by yourself. Lo hice como solita. Sí, sí. Okay. Sí, lo compartí, pero no, no. Ok, está bien. Dígamelo usted solito. Ok, our plan for the picnic rice is I'm going to walk around the river and going to eat fish and rice, vegetable, lemonade, and cape carrots. I'm going to eat a, a lunch bread and potato, mm -hmm. salad fresh, eggs, wine red, and cheesecake. Okay. That's it. That's it. Okay. Thank you so much, Silvia. Ya encontré, las, ya encontré los nombres de las rooms. Okay. Guys, tienen que hacer los ejercicios porque ese es el punto. Okay. Si no, si no participan, les voy a dejar otros ejercicios y va a ser individual porque si no, nadie lo va a entregar y yo voy a elegir a quien lo diga, right? Así que vamos ahorita. Ese fue el de Silvia y quisiera ver en la room 2 estaba Ana, Elmi, Jennifer. Did you finish the, the, the picnic plan? Yeah. Pero nos yeah. quedamos, yeah. estábamos decidiendo quién lo iba a leer. Ah, ok, ya. Yeah. Yeah. Who is gonna read it? ¿Quiere leerlo usted, Delmi? Delmi, ¿te gusta? En plan, the picnic plan is in the beach, en my dish. Uh, rice and chicken in French fish with the salad and apple with carrots, onions, mm -hmm. vinegar, vinagre, what you say? Uh huh. Um, the other salad is rouge salad with the Mayonnaise and beet and Korean cilantro. What do you say the correct pronunciation? Cilantro. Eh, me dijo cilantro, ¿verdad? Yes. It's like, um, well, you can say like cilantro too. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> cilantro too. It's okay. Porque lo buscamos y aparece como Korean, pero es como difícil pronunciarlo. Yo lo he escuchado como cilantro también. Ok. Like cilantro. And the complication. Cilantro. Uh -huh. Yeah. Ok. And the dress it. A fruit salad. Uh -huh. in, uh, nosotros lo conocemos como tutti frutti. In, nosotros lo buscamos y aparece como fruit salad. Ajá. Uh -huh. um, okay. es, strawberry jam. And milk mm -hmm. uh, for and drink uh, or chata and soda. Okay. 
Excellent, that was great. Okay, thank you so much, room number two. Okay, um, I like it. Me gusta. Okay, it was great. Remember that is, uh, it's important uh, to use the correct stance when you are talking about plants. And that was the point. Um, vamos a hacer otro pequeño ejercicio en vez de movernos al siguiente tense porque creo que aquí necesitan algunas personitas que no han estado muy presentes en la clase participar. So, vamos a hacer esta pregunta. Esta no era para hoy, era de ayer, creo. Um, quiero ver. This is what are you doing on your vacations? On your vacations. Ok. Esto es individual. Y tienen que ser al menos cuatro oraciones, ok, de cosas que ustedes están haciendo en sus vacaciones, imagínense que ya están vacaciones, so you're going to do it, I'm going to give you only five minutes, ok only five minutes to do it no nos vamos a ir a las break up rooms, va a ser aquí mismo, ok, so go, I'm going to be here waiting for you in five minutes, vamos a ver, yo voy a elegir a quien lo comparta, así que please please hagan el ejercicio ahorita go And you can tell me if you have any questions, of course.
Okay, how you doing? Come on. Everyone's ready for this? No, not yet. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay, perfect. That's the attitude. Okay, like it's just like practicing the present progressive that was the last tense. And there is like only one tense for tomorrow and the last one. And we're going to see like your examples about it. Okay, so I would like to heard like, let me see, Leslie, Tatiana, you there? Leslie? Yes, aquí está. Okay, Leslie, could you please tell us your exercise? What are you doing on your vacations? Ah, sí, me dijo que tenía problemas con el audio, es cierto, fue usted. Ajá, okay. Dice, sí, sí, aquí nos lo dejó. Lo, lo voy a leer para, para que ustedes escuchen. Dice, I will go to the beach with my family. We will eat a shell cocktail. I will read the books that I like and I will listen to a lot of music. Okay, thank you so much, Leslie. That was good. Okay, thank you. Let me see. Uh, Mr. Andre Alejandra? Está bien, ya pasó. Sorry. Eh, hello. Mm -hmm. I am doing the following activities on my vacation. Mm -hmm. In the morning, I rest as much as possible. The afternoon. I play basketball and in the evening I go out to the dinner with my friends. Uh, at weekends, I visit my grandmother and we also go to the beach to spend together. Mm -hmm. That's it. See? Sí. Yeah. Okay, thank you. You did it so great, okay? We're using, like, the simple future to talk about it, okay? It was good. Thank you so much, Andrea Alejandra. Okay. I would like to listen to Vanessa Arana. You there? Hi. Hi. Would you share us your exercise? I sleep on my vacation, go to the beach, reunity with my family, go to the fire. Okay, just um, you just say it in simple present, but remember when we are talking about like a progressive action, we talk it uh with the, the simple, no, the present progressive. Ay, no sé por qué siempre le digo simple present. No, no, present progressive, que es el present progresivo, right? So remember when we are talking about progressive actions, is like um you need to talk with the present progressive, okay? Don't forget it. Don't forget it. Eso no se les olvide. Las acciones progresivas son presente progresivo y el verbo va con ing. Like, um, if I am talking like I am doing, or you can say it like for a plan, like the way that Leslie does. Um, she does it like with the simple future. And she say like, I will go to the beach. I uh, will eat the shell cocktail in like this. Because this isn't like a daily routine because you have not vacations like a lot of uh, other vacations. Um, and we were talking like about an specific vacations. So we're not going to use a simple present, but... And it's okay if you want to say it like in progressive if you were there, like I'm going to do it. And um a simple future, of course. Uh will and go. Will and go, it's okay. If you are not sure or you if you are sure, right, you use the go to and a will. 
Ok, so, uh, de las personitas que me quedan, ¿alguien quiere ofrecerse voluntariamente a compartir el ejercicio? Jennifer, ok, I'm listening to you. Ok, vamos a ver. Uh, the question is, what are you doing on the vacation? I like uh, clean my house. Um, listen schools. I move my furniture and change my living room. I visit uh who's my mother, but she loves see my son. No, my daughter, sorry. Uh, when my husband is, is here, we going to the beach. Uh we also sleep looking in the sky. Uh we're going to the towns, for example, Alegría, Apanepa, Apaneca, perdón, Salquatitan. Uh, or if we don't have a lot of money, uh, we buy drink and a snack and driving uh, far away. Uh, we love to look good, not good. Okay. Yeah, it was great. Applause to you too. Thank you so much. Thank Katie. you very much. Cool. So I think the present progress and simple future are good right now. So I need to know if you have questions about it. Preguntas de estos en específico, estos tens en específico. No. Nothing. No, too clear. Everything is good. Okay, perfect. So if you don't have questions, I'm going to see you tomorrow in class. Don't forget to work in the platform and do the final exam, okay? See you tomorrow. Bye. Bye, Jess. Bye. Bye. Take care. See you tomorrow. Have a good night. Bye. Good night.